Hi friends, welcome to my channel Magic Star of Mathematics with Magic Methods. In my previous video, I had solved some examples with the help of a trigonometric table that is TigoTab. Today, we will solve some more examples. Look at these examples. Today, we will solve these three examples one by one. I have given screenshots of the solved examples in the at a glance section. Friends, you will never find false claims for cheap popularity in my video. Here you will learn pure mathematics without any drama. Now enjoy the video till the end. Let us take the first example. In triangle PQR, angle Q is equal to 90 degrees, angle P is equal to 45 degrees, and PQ equal to X. We have to determine angle R and the length of QR and hypotenuse PR. See in the figure. Angle Q is equal to 90 degrees, angle P is equal to 45 degrees, and PQ is equal to X. In triangle PQR, angle Q is equal to 90 degrees. And we know that in the right angle triangle, the sum of the other two angles is equal to 90 degrees. The other two angles means angle P and angle R. So we can write angle P plus angle R is equal to 90 degrees. But we know that angle P is equal to 45 degrees. Therefore, 45 degrees plus angle R is equal to 90 degrees. Therefore, angle R is equal to 90 degrees minus 45 degrees is equal to 45 degrees. So, we put R is equal to 45 degrees in the figure. Hence, angle P is equal to 45 degrees and angle R is equal to 45 degrees. So, angle P is equal to angle R. And we know that the side opposite to equal angles of a triangle are equal. The side opposite to angle P is QR and the side opposite to angle R is PQ. So we can write QR is equal to PQ but PQ is equal to X. So we put PQ equal to X therefore QR is equal to X and we write QR is equal to X in the figure. We know that by the definition of sin, sin R is equal to PQ upon PR, where angle R is equal to 45 degrees and PQ is equal to X. So sin 45 degrees is equal to X upon PR. Now look at the trigo tab. In the first row, theta is equal to 45 degrees and in the second row, sin theta equal to 1 upon root 2. So we write sin 45 degrees is equal to 1 upon root 2. Therefore, 1 upon root 2 is equal to x upon pr. And 1 into pr is equal to pr. And root 2 into x is equal to root 2x. So we have pr is equal to root 2x. Now look at the second method to find the length of the hypotenuse pr. Here we can use Pythagoras theorem. PR square equal to PQ square plus QR square where PQ is equal to X and QR is equal to X. So PR square equal to X square plus X square. Therefore PR square equal to 2X square. Taking square root of both sides we get PR is equal to root 2x where square root of 2 is root 2 square root of x square equal to x therefore pr is equal to root 2x and we put pr is equal to root 2x in the figure hence we have angle r is equal to 45 degrees qr is equal to x and hypotenuse pr is equal to root 2x let us take the second example if sin a plus b is equal to root 3 by 2 
and cos of a minus b is equal to root 3 by 2 where a and b are acute angles we have to find a and b where a greater than b we have given that sin of a plus b is equal to root 3 by 2 now look at the trigo tab see in the first row find the angle when sin theta is equal to root 3 by 2 we have theta is equal to 60 degree so we have sin 60 degrees is equal to root 3 by 2 comparing we get sin of a plus b is equal to sin 60 degrees therefore a plus b is equal to 60 degrees this is our first equation again we have given that cos of angle a minus b is equal to root 3 upon 2 now look at the trigo tab in the third row cos theta is equal to root 3 by 2 and in the first row theta is equal to 30 degrees so we write cos 30 degrees is equal to root 3 by 2 comparing we get cos of a minus b is equal to cos of 30 degrees therefore a minus b is equal to 30 degrees this is our second equation to find a and b we have to solve equation 1 and 2 adding 1 and 2 we get from first equation a plus b is equal to 60 degrees and from the second equation we have a minus b is equal to 30 degrees therefore a plus a is equal to twice a plus b minus b cancel 60 degrees plus 30 degrees equal to 90 degrees therefore twice a is equal to 90 degrees and dividing both sides by 2 we get a is equal to 45 degrees now look at the first equation a plus b is equal to 60 degrees where angle a is equal to 45 degrees therefore 45 degrees plus b is equal to 60 degrees therefore b is equal to 60 degrees minus 45 degrees therefore b is equal to 15 degrees hence we have angle a is equal to 45 degrees and angle b is equal to 15 degrees now let us take the third example if cot of a plus b equal to 1 upon root 3 and cot of a minus b equal to root 3 where a and b are acute angles we have to find angle a and angle b where a is greater than b we have given that cot of a plus b is equal to 1 upon root 3 look at the trigo tab in the last row cot theta is equal to 1 upon root 3 and in the first row theta is equal to 60 degrees so we write cot 60 degrees is equal to 1 upon root 3 now comparing we get cot of a plus b is equal to cot 60 degrees therefore a plus b is equal to 60 degrees this is our first equation again we have given that cot of a minus b is equal to root 3 look at the trigo tab see in the last row cot theta is equal to root 3 and theta is equal to 30 degrees so we can write cot 30 degrees is equal to root 3 comparing we get cot of a minus b is equal to cot 30 degrees therefore a minus b is equal to 30 degrees this is our second equation now to find 
a and b we have to solve equation 1 and 2 adding 1 and 2 we get from the first equation a plus b equal to 60 degrees and from the second a minus b is equal to 30 degrees a plus b a is equal to twice a plus b minus b cancel 60 degrees plus 30 degrees equal to 90 degrees therefore twice a is equal to 90 degrees dividing both sides by 2 we get angle a is equal to 45 degrees now look at the first equation we have a plus b is equal to 60 degrees where a is equal to 45 degrees therefore 45 degrees plus b is equal to 60 degrees therefore b is equal to 60 degrees minus 45 degrees therefore b is equal to 15 degrees hence we have angle a equal to 45 degrees and angle b is equal to 15 degrees